What's up guys, welcome to your 80th Android tutorial for the new Boston. What we're going to do in this tutorial is basically set up uh, an on long click listener. I'm not sure if we, I don't think we've done that before, so that's what uh, this tutorial is going to do. The on long click list, uh, listener can be used for buttons, but since this uh, sound stuff class only has a view, uh, we're just going to set the on long click listener view to this as well. So what we're going to do is we're just going to hit view.set on long click listener and hit that and then we're just gonna you know say this as well and then we're gonna implement or uh, basically let uh, sound stuff our class implement the on long click listener as well so again it just puts a comma on long click listener and then we're just gonna say add unimplemented methods and down here is our on long click listener now what we're gonna do is we're gonna set up a media player uh, variable or object as well. We're going to call this MP, and then we're going to set this equal to media player dot uh, create context this and resources r dot id dot. I mean r dot what? What? What's going on? I'm sorry. R dot uh, raw dot, and then our background music. And again, we're just going to set this variable so our whole class, our, all of our methods can use it. So we're just going to cut that and do mp here and then set up our object above the onCreate method. So there we go. We basically set up a media player as well. And now what we're going to do is we're just going to say mp.start down here. And we're basically good to go. I mean, now when we, basically what this on long click is is if we click and hold for like a second or something I don't know, I don't know the exact time it's going to call this on long click method instead of this on click method um, and again this can be applied to buttons and all that other stuff as well and again the difference between the media player and the sound pool is the sound pool will allow it to basically be loaded into memory whereas you know the, the other way it's going to kind of stream it, it's going to take a while. So the again, the sound pool is just short clips that can be played quickly and effectively um, and that's what you're going to use sound pool for whereas you want a longer background um, sound you're going to use the media player. So again, nothing too new. We set up a media player and this on long click method for the most part and that's all that's going to happen. Alright, so we're just basically going to start it now again it's going to kind of you know if we do this click and hold a few times it's going to play over itself for the most part but that's not really going to be a problem we're going to worry about um, basically this tutorial is just talking about the on long click method um, so yeah it's not the most efficient little application but that's fine you know just to introduce this new method that you guys can use for buttons or views or whatever you guys want to use this on long click for um, and let's get this started up here. Turn up the volume. Sound stuff. And if I just click quickly, it's still just playing our sound pool, but if I click and hold, it starts our music. And then we can still click, and it plays our sound pool stuff, as you can see. And then there we go I mean there we go I mean that's pretty much all this tutorial is is about the on long click method that you guys can use for buttons